Hello, and welcome to Come West Along the Road. This week we have a programme featuring the Chieftains, the group that, more than any other, can claim to have made Irish traditional instrumental music into an international genre. The story of the Chieftains is pretty well known by now. It begins with a number of outstanding and experienced traditional musicians living in Dublin in the late 1950s. Some of them are from Dublin, others are from elsewhere, but living in Dublin. All of them have day jobs, but for enjoyment they play in a variety of bands and groups. About 1960, they are variously invited by the Cork musician Sean O'Riada, then musical director of the Abbey Theatre, to join his new folk orchestra, Kjolthori Kulen, and to develop with him new ensemble arrangements of Irish traditional music. This group is hugely successful, and about 1963, some of the members of Kjolthori Kulen decide to try life for a while as professional musicians. They make their first LP for Kernini Kladik in 1964, take to the road, or the skies to be more exact, and the rest is history. I think of the chieftains as falling into two periods, the old chieftains and the new chieftains, although of course the distinction is not actually that simple. When we join the group for the first time here in the Great Hall of University College Dublin on Earlsford Terrace in December 1974, the original core membership was still in place. Paddy Maloney and Ellen Pipes, Sean Potts and Whistle, Michael Tuberty and Flute and Concertina, and Sean Keane and Martin Fay on Fiddles. But they have been joined by Father Mercier and Bowron and Bones, and by the Belfast orchestral musician Derek Bell.
The Old Chieftains on rather grainy film in 1974 with an Alangin Vuinok, the Munster Cloak, and Mark Lua e Nail, O'Neill's Cavalcade. We move forward now 11 years to May 1985 and to the National Stadium in Dublin, where the film is bright and clean and the music is even more energetic. The new chieftains are now in place. Sean Potts, Michael Tuberty and Pather Mercier are no longer with the group. But in their stead have come Dubliner Kevin Kniff from the Tradition Club in Slattery's and Capel Street and Roscommon man Matt Malloy, formerly of the Bothy Band and Planksty. The group is still led, of course, by Paddy Maloney, the person most responsible as musician and entrepreneur for the enduring success of the Chieftains over all the years. They're playing here a sequence in which the individual talents of the members are highlighted. Watch out in particular for the edge of the precipice fiddle playing of Sean Keane.
Georgie and I'm here because I'm here. I'm only six months older than I was this time last year. I am. Didn't do ray out, did do ray out, did do ray you ray Dum did dum did do ray out, did do ray you ray The more a man has, the more a man wants. Well, this I don't think true. I never met a man with one black eye who wished that he had two ray out. Didn't do ray out, didn't do ray out, didn't do ray you ray Dum did dum did do ray out, did do ray you ray Early to bed and early to rise, this I don't think true. How in the hell can a man go to bed if he has gone to go to Raya? Did you do Raya? Did you do Raya? Did you do Raya? Raya? Dum da dum did you do Raya? Did you do Raya? Raya? Never throw a brick to a drowning man if you're close to a grocery store. Throw him a bar of sunlight so black and wash himself ashore. Raya. Did you do Raya? Did you do Raya? Did you do Raya? Raya? Dum da dum did you do Raya? Did you do Raya? Raya? I think I've said enough, so I'll say no more. So before you show me the door, I'll take a bow and I'll leave you now, and I won't come back anymore. Oh yeah. Didn't do right, yeah. Didn't do right, yeah. Didn't do right, you right, yeah. Dum da dum da 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 Thank <laughs> you.